What's up? This is Timo Cruz. I'm here doing a quick interview about my newest EP called College Parties and Fake Dreams. Obviously, it's talking about you know college itself and the good times and the kind of bad times and the things that you go through in college. Um, me personally, I haven't been through college, but I know a lot of shit that kind of goes on there, which is why I didn't go. And a lot of people are now figuring out that they're in their third, fourth year in college and they're like, oh, you're right this whole time. So, yeah. It's Timo Tuesdays. What's the album about? So the album really is just, like I said, it's about college itself. And it's about not only the kind of good times, the, oh, hey, let's party, let's do this, let's live it up and meet people and find ourselves in college. But it's also about kind of the bad times and kind of like the fake dreams, as I call it, being like, oh, you want to be you know, this or that because your parents told you to be this. This isn't your dream. This is their dream for you. This is something that people gave to you rather than you found out yourself. And that's a thing that being right out of high school, you're not really taught and you probably don't know. You're probably just kind of like, hey, yeah, I'll do this because my mom said this is a good idea. My dad said this is a good idea. And you're probably lower class or middle class. And you kind of have no scale of doing these different things and finding your personality and you as just yourself and who you are and that's not even fault of your own it's just you're young and most people aren't mature enough to realize that what was the inspiration for this um the inspiration was kind of like similar to what it's about in a way it's just i wanted to make sure people that go into college are realizing you know hey there's good parts and there's bad parts you should take it seriously and you should have fun you know you can't stop and smell the roses too long but you should also live in the moment you know sometimes and, and just know how to have fun even if you're not uh in a good headspace or anything you got to learn how to really just live happy and, and you know take it day by day and, and get better one percent each day so when did i make this um i actually started making this back in either january or f february I don't remember. I want to say January. I made a lot of music out in January and February um, of this year, and I stopped making music after that for like three months or so. And then I started playing a lot of games. Um, I got back into R6, as a lot of people know, and I became a diamond in like two seasons. <clears throat> Although it's just on console, I do want to switch to PC, and I need a PC to, to run my music better anyway, so I do want to kind of build that. Um, but yeah, so I made a lot of these songs back then. Or at least I started on them and had the idea for it. And I think I actually had the idea last year, but I started on it this year and I had a song for this and a couple more EPs that are coming out later in the year that I won't get into. Um, and then the later songs I finished just in the past, maybe two, three months ago, kind of when I started getting back into music. But then I finished this album, I finished another album or, or you know, EP, finished this EP, this EP, this EP, a mixtape, another mixtape. There's a lot of stuff coming, put it that way. So how do I think people will react to this? Um, and well, I'm hoping they react in, in a way of, kind of like I said, where they'll be able to relate and just be able to be like, oh, hey, I've been through this, or I'm going through this now, or I bet my friend in college is doing this, or, you know, something like that. Or even if you're older and you're just in a party mood, hopefully you can throw on house party and be like, hey, or even if you're younger, like I said, maybe before you go into college, you can start to look at these different ideals and be like, oh, hey, Maybe I shouldn't do this, or maybe I should research more. Because um, I even say, you know, something like, uh, you know, we're, we're so young, so we got to believe, you know, and we're middle class. So it's basically how they taught us. It's the way to achieve, you know, in a way, I forget exactly how I say it, but like we believe that college is the only way to make it. And we believe that it's the only way we can achieve because that's what our parents told us, middle class and lower class. And that's just how it all is, you know, but that's really not true um, at all. So what am I working on next? Um, well, actually, I have, I believe, a single coming out this week um, called Where'd It Come From. That's a song I made back in, like I said, January, February. I had this whole year planned out. I'm just adding more now after I took my break. Shout out Bubbly. Um, this water's great. But... Um, so yeah, I have a single coming out, Where'd It Come From? I have another EP coming out, not this week, but the next week, at least from when this video is going to be coming out, I believe. 
um, which is called uh, Same Verse, Different Meaning, which is exactly what it sounds like. It's four different songs with the same verse but different meaning, but the choruses are different, and there's also an explanation as a fifth bonus track, so I'm not going to get too much into it. Maybe I'll do another interview about that. Uh, we'll see. And then I also have, I believe, another single coming out at the end of the month. I'm not sure off the top of my head what it's called. This was Timo Cruz, the interview on college. Parties and Fake Dreams, my newest DP out now. Definitely check it out. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it. So yeah.